Guys, the Infinity Blade has been vaulted. We did it. Hey, how's it going ladies and gentlemen of the internet? My name is Doodles and that is right, the Infinity Blade, the brand new mythical item in Fortnite Battle Royale is no more. It has been sent straight to the vault. And tell you the truth, it was long overdue. Despite the fact that it's only been in the game a few days, it should have just never came to fruition. It should have just been vaulted from the get-go. When they thought of the idea in their head, it should have just been sent straight to the vault and just left there because it absolutely sucked. So Fortnite put out a tweet just a little while ago that said, we messed up and rolled out the Infinity Blade overpowered without good counters, especially in the end game. The Infinity Blade has been vaulted and we are now re-evaluating our approach to mythic items. Thanks for calling us out on this. And man, the Fortnite community did just that. It actually made a video a little while ago. I was just gonna sit down and edit it tonight and upload it for you guys. Uh, talking about the Infinity Blade and how it is so overpowered and how it's basically taken a lot of the fun out of the game, especially with being across all default modes and uh, I checked out some stuff on Reddit over the last day or so and uh, there's been so much backlash about uh, the Infinity Blade even on Epic's own Reddit post uh, which I'm still going to post some of the stuff on screen for you guys throughout this video so you can see the comments on what the backlash was, what the community was saying about the Infinity Blade, you can see what everyone was thinking about it. It was also implemented in the North American Winter Royale Tournament uh, that happened just a couple of days ago, I believe it was the day before the tournament that the blade was introducing the game and it made it an absolute cluster it was it was just a complete it it was it, it was pretty bad now there was one guy i believe he won heat one and he used the blade to get the victory royale and he said in an interview that he felt like he cheated when he won the game he felt like he didn't deserve the win because he used the blade and if you've got sort of pro players playing on a fortnite tournament on fortnite's twitch and youtube channel saying that they felt like they cheated because they used it that, that's got to look pretty bad to epic like i said there was a lot of people on reddit twitter facebook everywhere talking about this about how much it ruined the game even pro players such as tifu and that were complaining about it as well it was not a good move by epic and the footage that you're seeing in the background this video was the last game that i've played of fortnite it was actually last night uh, where i was doing a team rumble game the other team got the sword and by the end of the game only me and three other players on my team remained because everyone's backed out everyone was just fed up of this sword uh, the people in the game were going around in a group of five or six one had the sword the rest of them had guns so basically it meant getting the sword was next to impossible and they just obliterated everyone it really took the fun out of the game and uh, i have not played it since but now obviously the infinity blade has been nerfed it's been vaulted rather i will be jumping back in and uh, like earlier today i jumped on to go and play a player game i turned it on i was just like nah cannot be bothered with this stuff so it's good to see that he's finally been vaulted and that means that uh Victory Royales can commence. Uh, so yeah, there's not a great deal to say about this whole situation. Obviously, we just got one tweet. It is now out of the game. It's officially confirmed to be out of the game. People have played. It is no longer there, which is great. Uh, whether we see mythic items in the game in the future or not, or whether they keep to their own LTM. Obviously, they said they are re-evaluating it. But whether that means that they're just rethinking the decision completely or whether they're thinking of the best way to implement them, I don't know. So we may see the sword back just in a completely nerfed fashion. I don't know. If they just did an LTM, like a mythic LTM, like the Thanos thing, I don't think people would care so much because you've got the option to use it if you want. Or maybe introduce more mythic items and have a mythic LTM where there's multiple mythic items on the map and it's a team-based thing where each team has a certain mythic item. I don't know. It could work out something cool like that, but I think just in the default game, more solos, dual squads, team rumble, whatever the large... A team game is in the game. I don't think it's got a place there, and I don't think it ever will. Even if they do nerf it uh, to the point of oblivion, I don't think this sort of thing needs to be in the game. Uh, it's not what made Fortnite great, and it definitely won't make it any greater than it already is. Uh, so that is the end of the video, guys. I wanted a quick one to let you guys know this little update with Fortnite Battle Royale. Like I said, I don't have to edit that video I made earlier now, because now I can jump straight back into Fortnite and have myself some fun. And I definitely want to jump back into solos now and trying to go for my next victory royale. Have you seen the video? of my first victory royale from last friday either tonight or tomorrow or some point in the near future i've been super super busy guys i had the chance to upload my uh, first victory royale from last week the second day of the season i got it and we're now in like the eighth or ninth day so yeah i should i should probably edit that for you guys
So yeah, that is the end of the video, guys. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this one today. If you did, if you want to see more Fortnite stuff like this on the channel, make sure you give this video a big fat thumbs up. If you're new around here, make sure you subscribe with notifications on. Click the subscribe button, click the notification bell, and click all. That way you'll never miss out on a video that goes live on the channel. Include all my Fortnite Season 7 content. And if you have missed out on any Fortnite Season 7 content, including my first victory royale, which will be coming up very, very soon, as well as their challenge guides for the weekly challenges. There'll be a playlist in the description box and on screen at the end of the video. Make sure you go and check it out. My name is Dills. I thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time.